before we jump into the freaky deaky, like, and I would, I pretty probably even listen to this stuff like that, you know what I'm saying? But so me and my little brother, we sit at the house the other day and he got his phone roll the phone. He's like, yeah, yeah, you know, I don't let this chick and she dance and this, this, that, and the third. <laughs> and this dude said something I had never ever come out of a dancer's mouth before in my life. What's she it? told Remember this time. guy, you, and you might you might be like, oh, so I, I know she that. told this guy that she didn't want him to throw any money on her because she was interested in him. I can understand that. So look, I look, I was like, wow, I've the never heard this in my life okay. before. Like you told this dude. I don't want you, she said, I didn't want you to throw any money on me because I was interested in you and, you know. I don't I, want you to see me as what you see me as, so don't throw me no money. I, 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 listen to what I'm saying. Okay, I'm retired, many years retired. Many years. Okay, so listen, it's different between having your customers at the club and having that one you're interested in at the club. Okay, listen to what I'm saying. Listen to what I'm saying. As a former retired, I'm retired. You know what I'm saying? Okay, if this dude, you don't want him to feel, you don't want to feel like he's doing the same thing that these dudes are doing. You know what I'm saying? He's going to give you the money regardless, you're going to get it. But you know what I'm saying? These niggas are throwing money at you because of what you're doing. Okay? And this is just your job. But your relationship is something else. Or the dude you're interested in is something else. So you might not want him to see you in the same light. Or you might not want to feel like he's one of the same dudes doing the same thing these dudes are doing. Like, they throwing money at you. You know what I'm saying? You don't want him to feel like he's throwing money at you with these niggas and you just what you are. Please don't throw no money at anybody because it's not like that. You know what I'm saying? You just give me my later. Now, see, like, this, this is my job. So let me do my job. Okay, that's your explanation. My ex my thing is this is your place of business. <laughs> and I see you how I see you. Because, you know, but when she said that to him, or when he said that she said that to him. I was like, that is the craziest thing I've ever heard. Ever. But you gotta think, she got niggas throwing money at her all day long. She don't want her man throwing money at her too. That's what she see all day long. She know what she doing. She's stripping, you know what I'm saying? This is her man. She don't want to have him do the same thing as what she doing all day. Just like if you at work cooking all day, you don't want to come home and have to cook too. Or if you at home cooking all day, you know, or, or cleaning up all day. You don't want to come home and have to cook too. Or you, you know what I'm saying? So it's one of those type of situations. If you're at work getting niggas throwing money at you all day, knowing these niggas being disrespectful as fuck, you don't want to have to go home where you can relax and know that your man did the same thing. You see what I'm saying? Because that's how he going to think. She don't want to be stripped or treated like a stripper by her man. By her man. Uh, you see what I'm saying? She like, wanted that nigga to save money. his money for something by somebody uh, else. I just... I had never heard anything like y'all. It I makes sense. Like, Whoa. That's because like, you've never been a female stripper. <laughs> man, <laughs> like shit with you. So you would never true. know, but, that's you true. know, females that have been through shit, they understand that. Have like, you, you been don't in want a relationship your man to do the same thing. No. Never. I was just wondering. Yeah, you don't want your man to do the same thing your customers are doing. That's different. I can't get just like one night when I just throw dollars. We'll do that at home. Okay, but you still like. But we're at home. And I'm your personal freak. So I'm going to do this and we're going to do this shit like I'm at the club, but you my man. You see what I'm saying? So yeah, yeah, baby, it's just me. You throw me this motherfucking money because it's me and you just what you want me to be tonight. When I'm at the club, I'm on a persona. You see what I'm saying? That's something different. These niggas I'm not going home with. I might not even see this nigga again, but he done gave me a band. You see what I'm saying? For me to buy the outfit that I'm about to wear for you tonight. Damn, but we're at home. God, you see what I'm saying? We're at home. Shit. You see what I'm saying? So that's, I'm your personal stripper at home. But if I'm at the club, don't throw me no money. Just watch my back. Because I'm going to get the bread. Okay. I understand. Okay. That's game. That will give them... Oh, I already read. They are so clueless. They are. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't want him throwing money. She wants him swiping cards and paying bills. She is a veteran. 